captured emotionally by the Italian coffee bar. The sound of the coffee machine, the steam, and the length of time that it took. It was that sense of you and I are part of the same club because we both know what a venti is. We convinced ourselves that a new flavor of Frappuccino was innovation, and uh, that's not innovation. You couldn't move from a few hundred shops to a few thousand shops to over 20,000 shops without losing something. You lost your soul in this journey. Well, there was a perception that there was a Starbucks on every corner. There was no doubt an element of, well, we got a bit tired of this. I'd like to get my ear pierced. Well, better make it quick, kiddo. In five minutes, this place is becoming a Starbucks. <laughs> It become almost like a fast food business. And I personally feel like it kind of lost the charm a little bit. I feel that uh, we were drifting a little bit towards mediocrity and kind of losing our voice, and I needed to come back. As companies get big and successful, and this happened to a degree at Starbucks, people get entitled, and success is not an entitlement. Uh, you have to earn it, you have to earn it every day, especially in the retail business. Oh, so wherever you are at 5.30, for three hours, they're going to shut down Starbucks. It's a good idea. Why? They got to get better. ダブルエスプレッソモカラテ、オッケー。地域の一番手の喫茶店というのありますよね。そうした地はやっぱりマスター、まあオーナーさんとお客さんのつなぎ非常に強いですよね。えっと店長さんにえっとオーナー意識、つまり自分があたかも経営者のような気持ちになってほ